Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome to this war of mine. Now, this is made by the same people who made Frostpunk apparently. I didn't know that up until now. This was, I played this game previously on my channel, but I never completed it. Now there are two things here. This is the uh, final cut of the game. So I also have the story mode for it. Are you playing the, fi the f uh, final cut first? And then we will be playing the story mode, like you can see here, there's story mode to it. So we will be playing this story mode, there are three different story modes and stuff. We'll be doing that as well. And there's also classic mode, which is this one. So my first uh, thing that I'm going to do is like, I'm going to go through the classic mode first. And then we'll be moving through the story mode next. The reason, simple reason for that is that... To, I want to like re-experience the whole game. Uh, you might as well experience a bit of here and there. Just check it out if I was recording because sometimes I don't record and I just babble on. That, and I'm just like, oh, I babbled on for so long and I didn't record. But my initial plan is that I'm gonna go through the classic mode first because I just want to go back through the experience of depression again. Uh, this game is really depressing with what it does and things that it can do so i'll be playing through this i don't know why i wanted to play this game i just had it in my mind it's just like you know what i want to play something depressing and i decided to play this one so here is hoping that everything goes fine <laughs> so i don't know i know can beat the game so i don't know how shit's gonna go but hopefully everything goes fine here is hoping everything goes fine. So we will have survivors at the start. Day one. Okay. Boy. It's been forever since I played this game, so. Gotta be something. So we got three survivors, as you can see. The game works in real time, so everything I have to do, I have to do in real time. I can't pause the game at any moment or anything like that. Well, I can pause the game, but I can't really do anything about it. Uh, broke out. Many people thought it would be last for a couple of weeks. It's been years since the military surrounded rebels in the capital, cutting off all the supply lines. The civilian population trapped in the city is suffering from hunger, disease, and shelling. Katia made both Pavel, Pavel and... Pavel, Pavle and Bruno before the war. She used to be a reporter while Bruno had his own television cooking show. Pavel was a star of a local football team. Okay, so a reporter, I don't know how, what that does. Cooking show means that Bruno is good at cooking, so I'm not going to be sending out. I'm pretty sure Bruno will be really good at uh, cooking, and so I don't want him to go out there and die and then lose our best guy who can cook stuff for our guys. Paolo is a star in a local football team. I think so this is the guy I would rather send out. Can't even interviewed once. Now they meet in dramatically different circumstances looking for food and shelter. Okay. So she's slightly sick. She's got bargaining sales, so that's good to know. Paolo is a fast runner. And Bruno is a good cook. So first things first, we have a few things we need to do. Katia is slightly sick. As much as I want her to like get shit done i can't really do anything uh next thing is next let's see what we can do here bruno uh check what is so here and tell me our things what do we have we have nothing actually so she's gonna just uh get past that trouble so we need a bunch of stuff and we don't have any of it we need some household items like bed we definitely need bed it's necessary because it can uh, give us, like, if somebody's feeling sick, it can make them better. We need a crude stove because that can get, help us uh, make food. Chair? I don't remember what chair does. Uh, in tough time. I guess this is for when people feel depressed, I guess. Simple heater is definitely going to be useful when things are cold. Radio is definitely going to be useful when, uh, like, oh. Things are going crazy, but batshit crazy. What does this do? Uh, booze. Okay, so this is again for some injuries and stuff. Can be used. 
Metal Workshop is obviously for making uh, lockpicks and stuff and uh, guns and stuff. Rainwater collection for cooking and making alcohol. Okay, that's not bad either. So there's everything is pretty bad. Uh, pretty much things that we need. We need fuel and fuel is for heater. We don't have a heater yet. If you check the filter, homemade. Okay, so none of the things I can make right now. So right now I'm just gonna look for Bruno. Bruno, wh what can you check over here? Uh, okay, so nothing over here either, right? So Bruno, go over here and check for this. So we gotta just check around things. It's locked, okay. Uh, I need something to open the lock. I don't have a lock pick, okay. That is good to know. How about you go up there and check on that? Katia is gonna take her time on doing this. Our weather is 20, 22 degrees Celsius. I'm guessing if it drops below 20 degrees Celsius, it's necessary. Oh uh, no, I didn't want to change it to Fahrenheit. But oh, you open this door. I yeah, it's gonna be tough to like keep an eye on uh, on everything that's happening. I think I have a fever. Don't worry, Katya. We'll find a bed or something for you soon, hopefully. But it's necessary that you work until then. Uh, check for whatever you can in this. There is also things over here. This is almost. She's almost done. How's she looking? No, no. How's she looking? Slightly sick, right? Check for this. There we go. Oh, that's what it is. Basic items. Yeah, definitely. Materials, take it. We need it. Uh, what else can we search for? This door is boarded, apparently. Okay, Katya is done with her job. Uh, we can go up there, but I feel like we should just check around. Nah, you know what, Katya? Check if we can open this door. Okay, you can. Alright, Katya. Uh, do this. You open the door? That's good. Uh, just to uh, take out the rubbles. Oh, there's some few things we can get. Herbs. Herbs are definitely gonna be useful. Materials we need all of it. Take, grab all. Why am I doing it one at a time? Okay. Katya, uh, go up. Oh. Yeah, grab all. We need stuff right now and... Yeah, Katya, go up there. And check for whatever we get. Check for this. Might be useful. So we can lockpick that. Good to know. Okay, good to know. Katya, oh, we need a bed for you. So let's quickly go and make a bed. Alright. Okay, you're gonna lockpick that. Uh, then you're gonna go cook some stuff for us, Bruno. That is better that way. Uh, grab all. Grab whatever you can. Bruno, can you cook stuff for us? Let's see. Uh, no, he's not hungry. So I'm thinking he doesn't need... I think that's just taking direct food. Okay, cut here. What can you make? Can you make a bed for us real quick? There we go. Uh, let's place it up on the upper side, I guess. Uh, so you can only place it over here. Let's place it over here. Alright. Uh, Bruno, uh, since things are not looking so good, why don't you go and check on that? Uh, no, check on this first. You, on the other end, go and do the rubble, probably. Okay. So, we can get the bed, which will help us definitely big time. Bruno, check this as well, while you're at it. Alright, good. Get some materials in. Bruno can build a cook thing. Katia can use it because she's feeling sick, so... Oh, she needs this. She does have... We do have a lockpick. Okay. Good. Bruno can build something for us. Katia, as soon as she feels better, we'll get her back up. Oh, there's a lot of things that I need to pay attention to. Uh, we definitely need a stove because Bruno can make uh, food for us then. And that's definitely going to be useful to us. Uh, alright. So, the stove would be really good around here somewhere. Alright, Bruno. Go. Alright. Time to get some more rubble done. 
we cleaned up the place, which is a good thing. And that's just set down, okay. We need to open the log door as well, so it's necessary that we pay attention to everything. Alright. Bruno can make food for us, which will be really good. Katia is recovering, that's good to know. No, Bruno, Bruno, continue doing what you're doing. I mean, Paule. Jeez, keeping the track of their names is hard for me. Okay, you can make food for us, right? Cooked food. Ah, oh, you need the consumables, okay. Uh, we can make three of them for now, right? All right. You get to know that he's doing his job. Our day will end soon. I want to make maximum use of our days because I'm pretty sure we will be in that situation where we. Uh, no, 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 no. You can continue sleeping, Katya. You need to recover. You're slightly ill. All right. We can make uh, cooked food. And what is this? It gets even better. What's the difference between this and this? I would need carrots for this. Okay. So we can make two of this. We can only make one of. Oh, because we don't have enough water. Okay, that's good to know. Alright, we'll make this then. We'll make one food. So we know that there is a, there is food made. So whoever is feeling hungry, right now nobody's feeling hungry. So whenever somebody feels hungry, we basically just uh, have to uh, get the stuff. Metal workshop, we don't need that much right now. Radio would be really, really useful though. Like seriously useful. Homemade oh, single use. I need to make a rainwater collector in first more than anything. Just what do we need for it? We are lacking a few things. So we'll just make a radio real quick. Uh radio would be good up here somewhere. Uh sure, I'll place it over here. Why not? So we know we can take that uh, and then we can continue on with a few more things. Right? Good. So we cleared up a lot of things on the first day, which is important. Ah, oh, frick. That's locked. Alright, uh, Bruno, do your thing. We are almost out of time. Hopefully this will be completed by the time we are done. Is she feeling better? She's still slightly sick. She's recovering. Oh, uh, no, no, no. Just do your thing. Uh, instead us to warn listeners not to cross the front line. Failure to comply would result in date. Dead. Despite desperate counterattacks, while the rebel trying to lift the siege of Ogoran, the city remains cut off. Government forces do not allow any aid to reach the city. Believe it would end up in rebel, rebel hands. Music is playing. Okay. It's the same thing, right? There isn't anything here. Yeah, there isn't anything useful there. Alright, uh, Bruno... Bruno, what do you do, Bruno? Um... I don't have anything to do. Well, we can try and do more things. Okay, it's a night. Anyways. So, Katya can sleep in the bed. She's slightly sick, so that's useful. Why does Katya have... Oh, Bruno has less. Okay. So she can sleep in the bed. It's no use. Uh, Bruno sleep. No, sleep. Uh, just sleep. Sleep in the bed. Uh, should I put him on guard duty? We don't have anything that useful yet, right? So we can just have these two sleep. Uh, Pauly, scounge. Okay. So, shelled cottage. Semi-detached house. Danger, okay. A lot of parts, some weapons. A lot of parts, huge amount of weapons, huge amount of materials. Alright, oh, uh, many others are still burning. People are fleeing for their lives in a hurry. So we may find some useful stuff here without meeting anybody. It's been inhabited by homeless since long before the war. They have always been struggling with lack of food and might not have survived the recent sh shortages. There shouldn't be a threat and we could find some useful things here. So here's a huge amount of materials, some weapons and lots of parts. I'm thinking we go, go over here because 
what I'm thinking is shell the cottage while there is oh there's a lot of meds as well here might be useful to go there there's less food but a lot of materials and meds as for you there are no meds that's the thing yeah I'm going to I'm going to the shell the cottage I'm not taking any materials with me uh I don't think it's and it's of any use taking any materials with him so let's go and scavenge we have 12 space anyways and it's better to keep it like that. Okay, start from over here. Alright, we have a boarding house on our hand. Material. Okay, so we know there is material over here. We'll pu push all the materials over here and then we'll take them with us. We will put all the materials over here that we have. So that we can... We'll put all the materials over here for the timing. Alright, there we go. So, for the timing, this will be our material spot. Let's make sure. Oh, frick. Doesn't see like there is anybody, so we should be just fine. I shouldn't double click because double click means that I go faster. So, we got food over here, which is again really, really useful. And some more stuff over here that we can most probably see. Okay. So let's clear this out real quick. Uh, we'll take we'll take whatever material something is there. I guess that's a rat. Because I did see a rat over there. So let's uh, push all these materials out here again. That's a material gathering spot. Because we don't have enough space, right? For gathering materials. So we're gonna push all the materials over here. So we see bandages, which is really good news for us. Alright, there we go. That's the place we keep our materials. So we can come back over here, take all that materials and go back. Uh, there is some other materials over here, but I'm not feeling like it. It's a burning house. I don't think so there will be anybody over here. So we should be able to get some materials out of it. We don't want to go into dangerous places because it's going to dangerous places will be really bad for us. Grab all of that. Is there anybody over here? Doesn't look like it. So it's like I said, it's a burning house. We don't have a tool or anything. I think we should be just fine going down. Alright, let's check over here just in case we have something. Alright. Uh. Okay, we don't have enough space for this. We still have enough time in night time. That we can do this. Right now, what is the need? I know, shovel is important. I know. But I have no choice. I don't have a shovel right now with me. So it's going to take a while for us. I'm guessing after the first night we might get a shovel. Because we definitely need... We don't have a blueprint either for making a shovel, right? So I need to upgrade for a blueprint as well. But I'm thinking that we should be just fine. Because there's nobody here. And I'm not afraid to try my hand out with things here. So we can just come back over here for all the materials. And go back to our place again and again every night. And stock up on materials. It's an easier way to play the game. Uh, I've thought about it. Sometimes there might be people over here. And that's the dangerous part. We don't know if there are people here or not. And materials do go... Uh, if you gather all the materials from a single spot. They do go away. They do not stay. So like you don't get uh, like respawning materials from these spots. So that's uh, another thing I need to be careful of. I have to take whatever is necessary for me right now and leave everything else. So like there are some places that I can't lockpick yet. Yeah, there we go. Let's also clear this rubble so that we make sure that we have all the stuff that we can uh, get. So like uh, I can go over here again. These drawers are locked so I can just lockpick them later on by making some lockpicks. For that I need the metal table and I don't have the metal table yet. So, like, uh, getting a metal table is going to be so useful to us, like, 
I think so I'm just gonna get the muddle table next uh, next day. How much time do we have? We have I think so we have more than enough time to get the materials and then go back. Yeah, I think so it'll be more than enough time. Like I think so we should be able to be done. We're halfway done with this. Hey, here's something? I don't think so I think I heard anything. Cause this place is abandoned, there is nobody here. The game gets tougher later on when people do appear in abandoned places. That's the, that's when it actually gets tough. So that's my strategy usually because I know people will appear here later on, and I don't want to risk my guys dying. It's it's too heavy for everybody to if one of our guys dies, and I don't want that. So like we need to be careful about how we proceed with things, and bringing these stuff out, like these important things out, is so so important for our guys. Like, it's literally one of the most important stuff that done. Okay, this these all stuff, we need to go and get it later on. Let's move here again, and let's quickly move here now. We don't have much time left, so we should just most probably dump the stuff that we have over here real quick. Alright, let's start dropping stuff left, right, center. Alright. There are a few things that, left, uh, that, are left to get, that I have left together. Quickly gather that. There isn't much time left. I think so I have like 5 a.m. up to 5 a.m. Alright, let's go up here again. Gather these stuff. So I know all my uh, gathering spots and everything. Since I have played this game in the past, I have never completed it. Like again, I say. Alright. So we are almost full. Okay, so I got everything I could right now. Let's drop everything first so that we can later, uh, like, do this. We definitely need the bandages in case anybody gets ventured. Coffee, uh... That would be really good, honestly. I'll take coffee as well. Herbal meds, definitely. Cigarettes we can sell later on. But we need food. We can use this in our garden to grow herbs or vegetables or has bait in a trap for small animals. Vegetables. Uh, that's definitely something we can use. Uh, we'll keep the herbal medicines for time. Material. Gun material. Very important we take it. We don't want to lose that. Sugar. Essential for fermentation process. Clean water. We will take clean water. Okay. Clean water we did. We'll take uh, one bunch of sugar as well. Parts will take it. Alright, so we have two spaces, right? Uh, I'm thinking we take this as well. Okay. And... We take... All of yo. And... This. There we go. So I'm thinking this is fine for the time being. We've got every part we could. Next time I come around here, I will get materials. So we just get materials next time we come around here. So, Paolo is back, which is a good thing. We want to see that screen as much as possible, that whenever we send our people out, they are back. There isn't anything important that I need to guard, so I'm fine if there is, they like, uh, don't have anything. Okay, good. Uh, we got ourselves things. Good. A scavenge was a successful one. Paolo is hungry and tired, so let's have him eat. You are slept poorly, okay. And you are hungry as well. So, after Pablo is done eating, what about you? Did you sleep well? Okay, you're better now. That's good to know. Uh, Pablo, where are you, Pablo? Uh, Bruno, do your thing. Uh, make two of that, because Katya will need one as well. Pablo, go ahead and sleep. You're tired. So that's important. Katya. Uh, wait for it. Alright. Have your food. After you're done having food. Holy shit, the war is going crazy. After you're done ha uh, having your food, go up there. Well, he sadly slept poorly, so... He's not doing that hot right now. 
We have to make sure our guys have food every single time. I don't want my guys to, like, not have food. We gotta make sure that uh, Bruno is the one cooking all of us. The rebel leader instructed us to warn the listeners not to cross. Okay, it's the same thing. It's the same thing again. Okay, there's nothing useful here. Katia, what can you do for me now? Make some stuff for me. Calming music. That's actually really, really nice to have. Okay, Katia. Uh, bed. So, I could have two beds now. Or... Mm, I'm thinking. Nothing useful here. What if I do this? Don't have enough stuff for that. We do have enough stuff. We just need to go and get it. What is that again? I'm not sure what it is. Mm. Bruno is taking his time resting. There isn't anything Katya can do right now, honestly. Unless there's something there that she can do. But that's a locked one, so I don't think so she can do anything with, about that either. Alright, Bruno is almost done, so that's good to know. Yeah, that's a locked uh, locker, so she can't do much. Or not just sit down, Katya. Okay, Bruno, see what you can find. Uh, is there anything interesting that Bruno can define? Okay, this is this is sellable. So there is a merchant that comes from time to time. We can sell him stuff. So this is a sellable stuff, which is really good. Let's grab it. Alright, so there isn't anything here. Let's go and do this real quick. Do you have anything uh, consumables? We have a bunch of these things, so we can make like four of it, right? I will make like five. Let's see that. So like Bruno can work on those things. And there, since there's nothing else remaining in our place that we can do, unless we have lockpicks, I'm thinking that we just leave it be. We just leave it be because... Uh, Literally, there's nothing I can do right now. And the best thing I can do right now is wait. Okay. Paul is back as well. Just to check on it. Uh, next thing I need is a rainwater collector. And for that, I need material. So we need to bring these things next. And simple heater also needs these things. So for now, what I'm thinking is I make another bed for our guys. Uh, again, we just have materials, so I'm fine with just not uh, having a guard uh, right now. So we can just have two beds over there. Uh, and, uh, I'm fine with that, just having them like sleep for the time being. Because, again, no real need for anything. Uh, simple cook meal, more nutritious and test here. So, the, does this mean that I can make two meals? We'll just figure out. Yeah, I can... I'm guessing, like... We can just make meals here. I don't know. Does it mean that only two meals will appear? Only two meals. Okay. You can sleep, Bruno. Alright. So, there isn't anything uh, left to do right now, I think so. Because all of these need lockpicks, and I don't have lockpicks right now. So, um, I'm thinking it's ending the day right now. We just have to bring some more materials uh, uh, this night. So, we're just gonna go again to the uh, cottage. Because there is literally no other reason uh, to uh, go. To... Since you slept uh, poorly, you can sleep in the bed. Uh, go on scavenging duty. Again, we don't have anything specific that we need. We have two beds. We can have both of them sleep in the bed. So... We don't need anything specific right now because we are just trying to build up our base and everything. Uh, don't need anything specific again. Yeah, I'm good with it. Let's just scavenge. It's literally outside. We just need to take it all. If there are people, there are people. 
But we can just scavenge it all. Katia can just uh, scavenge everything for me. Uh, these are not things we need right now. We need materials. So we'll uh, fill out the first uh, space with these. Okay, there we go. Do we need sugar? I don't remember if we need sugar. We might be lacking in food though, I feel like. Hmm. We might be lacking in food. That might be an issue that we might run into. Not gonna lie. That might be an issue we might run into because I feel like one of the people will have to like be hungry. I can just guess that's the thing that I can do for. So now we bought mat material. We have been raided. Okay. What did it take? Uh, it's not that bad. Got slightly wounded. That's sad. Both of you just sleep. Recover from your wounds. Because we just don't want... Uh, you know what? Katia can stay hungry. She's tired, but we, we can't help with it. Both of you guys are injured. So, like, you both have food. And after that... I don't think so we can do anything about this thing. Kati is tired. So... That's the sad part. She's tired. Okay. Uh, moonshine. Don't need it. Water purifier. Need it. We need water purifiers. We also need a heater. How's the temperature? Not looking hot. It's getting uh, worse with every passing moment. That's going to take a lot of materials. I have to decide what I take on here. If I take this, I can't build anything else. Heater, I can just build later on, I feel like. Yeah, I'm feeling a little rainwater collector. It would be nice to have that. I'll just place it here. Go. Do your thing, Katia. She's tired, but again, you guys need to recover more than anything. You're hungry, just have food. These guys need to recover more than anything they need to recover. Because... Is there a food that we can make? No, right. We need actual food. To make food. Oh boy. So Katia will be hungry for this night. That's a sad uh, reality we have right now. Sometimes we just have to be with hunger. Alright, so we need to get some fertilizers done. Oh, it's a trader. Yeah, yeah, we have some stuff. We can... Actually, that's really great timing. That is actually a pretty good timing. Let's see. So, we can uh, get stuff from him. Great timing from him. Shh. There we go. Uh, let's see. Oh, did I just give him for free? Okay, no. It's over here. Mm, I don't want to exchange anything else, but... I would like some food. Raw food for that. Canned food, maybe? Okay. Raw food. And few materials. Okay. Not that many. Can you give me this? Okay, good. We can get a few more? I want to inch as much things as possible. No. He doesn't like it. Can we get this? If I take it away? Oh, uh, no. So I'm just looking for as much of an offer I can get. So, I can get one of these. Or I can get a bunch of these. No, I can get one of these. Okay. That is good to know. I'll take one of these then. Okay, so that's a deal we can get. We got a really good deal uh, on our hands, I think so. Really good timing. Okay. That's all. Thank you. Now, Katya has to cook her own food, sadly. So, what do we see here? 
we don't have any components to build. He's slightly wounded, so just uh, do your thing, uh, Pauli. Okay, uh... Oh, I need a clean water. I'm stupid. I need clean water. No, I have clean water. What do I need? Oh, fuel. Oh, fuel is easy. We can just use one of these. I didn't know it was fuel that we needed. Katya has to make our own food here. Because both are, our cook is sick. What am I missing? Oh, I'm missing clean waters. No, clean waters. What? Wait, wait. Did it say that... I'm, I'm so confused. It said... 2 out of 4. 5 out of... Oh, it is clean water that I'm missing. I'm stupid. Okay, so we do need clean water. Welp, Katya is gonna be hungry for a while. Because of my stupidity. I'm sorry, Katya. So, I have to think about this. So, I already built a purifier. Metal workshop. It's a, it's a very simple answer. Metal workshop has to be the next thing that I build. Because that'll give us uh, more options. Uh, I'm thinking I put it over here. That'll give us more options, actually. Because that will then make it th so that we can build lockpicks and guns and stuff and that's gonna be so useful to us especially the guns we can just have them uh have it uh, on uh, one of our guys and just have them on guard duty and that's gonna make such a big difference it'll be kind of crazy all right cut here good now we can have a crowbar Oh, we can build a block pick. We can only build a block pick, actually. Oh, building a shovel would be so good. But we don't have the materials for shovel. We need materials and a knife. We also would really, really uh, like to have a knife. But, hey. Uh, I'm going to build lock picks. I'm going to build two lock picks. And that's going to help us out a bit. This way, Katia can like go around and like check on stuff that hasn't been checked. Uh, if we can find this food and stuff, and that's gonna be great if we can find all that. If if we can't, well, we can't. Can't help it. Katia is not going anywhere today. It's Paule because we need to like figure out more more areas of the game. So we'll do one more night, and then we will be done for this video. I think so this video is a bit big, I just don't want to check it out. But I feel like it's 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 a little bit big. And it's gonna be like that because this game is uh, this game is pretty pretty much uh a game where there's a lot of things that matters. So I like will take my sweet time doing things. Uh not the materials I wanted, but I'll take it, I'll take it. Uh, let's open this lock door. Oh, this is gonna be bad, isn't it? We need a lot of lockpicks, honestly. Help! Hopefully, you guys uh, recover from your wounds because holy shit, we're gonna be in trouble otherwise. What I'm thinking is I put out Katya again for the night because here's what I'm thinking: we put out Katya again for the night. Just for the simple reason, here's my simple reasoning for that. She's gonna be there, tired. So, I'm just gonna think, I'm gonna have you come over here. Kati can stop and go rest. Because then she'll be fully rested, she'll only be hungry. That is an issue, she will be hungry. But we will be bringing food for everybody. And if we're bringing food for everybody, we can make sure that nobody's hungry. So we will bring food for everybody, and hopefully nobody gets sick. And that's uh, that's that's uh, that's my important thing that nobody gets sick right now. Because any of my guys get sick, I'm screwed. Uh, you also. I want you to. No, no, no. You continue doing what you're doing, Bruno. 
I don't want Katya to feel tired while she's out there. That might slow her down, I'm not sure. Okay, we can we can't get this, right? Yeah, we can't get the filter in. Pauli, if you can recover in time, you can recover in time, otherwise you're sending Katya out again. I don't want the wounds slowing you down and so hopefully everything goes fine. Bruno will never go out for me because he's a great cook and that matters a lot because sometimes people will make bad food which might give which might make them sick. And I don't want that. So Bruno stays at home all the time, even if even if there's shit that goes down at our place. It's necessary that Bruno survives for us because he's just such an important guy. Okay, so we can open this I'm pretty sure because we don't have a lockpick. So we're gonna end the day over here and see what happens. Alright, she's hungry, slightly wounded, tired and hungry. Ah, I don't want to send Bruno out. You sleep in the bed. Katya sleep in the bed. Scavenge. Actually, no. We need a guardian this this time around. Katya guard. She's already tired though. Bruno is slightly wounded. Bruno guard. Garage caution advised. Okay. Send Mary Church cautions. Danger. Okay, I'm going to your because there's a huge amount of materials. Not food. We need food. Some food. Garage, we can go. Hmm. Welp. Let's see if Pauli can do his thing. There isn't anything we need to take. We don't have anything to take, honestly. Oh boy. Hopefully, there isn't anything bad going on. So, you can. There's a lot of food over here. But caution advice, so we have to be careful here. Materials over here. This is our drop zone. No more hiding. No meat in heaven. Okay. Hopefully, we don't have to worry about things. Lots of things over here. Worth getting it. Alright, we'll just push everything over here again, like we do. This will be a spot to push things. So we have to remember where things are, like the only things that remain there are some sugars and materials. Yeah, the place you went through. We have to be very careful. Oh. Okay, so he needs meds. He needs meds. Hmm. So I can bring meds for him. Oh, this is where we can hide. Okay. So I can bring meds for him, which is not a bad thing. Can I just close this door? Thank you. God damn it. <laughs> I don't want to steal in front of him because then he'll think that. He'll think that I'm trying to steal stuff. He's gonna follow me. Well, can't help it. Oh, uh, we need some food. We don't have any meds. Run! <laughs> we are wounded. Oh wait, 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 wait. No, no, <laughs> we're wounded. I leave the scavenged things uh, back where they are. I don't know they're gone. What the hell? We are in trouble. Alright, so probably just get bandaged because this is going to be really bad. Alright, what do we have honestly? We have one food with us. 
that's it. No bandages, nothing. I mean, nothing we can do about it. You guys are hungry, slightly hungry. Why are you slightly hungry and hungry at the same time? Doesn't make any sense. The worst part is the game auto saves, so now like I can't save scum. Yeah, it takes less water to make things. Mm, I need purified water, but I don't have anything that can give me that. Is there anything that can give me that? Nope. Well, we're gonna end our day like that then. Why are you tired? Oh yeah, you were guarding. You're on guard duty. Let's have you both sleep and Welp Let's see. He's wounded, so I'll let him sleep. Kate go scavenging. We don't have anything honestly. What are they gonna steal from us? Some food? Yeah, that can be the case. We don't need food though. Quiet house. Oh my god, that's a lot of things. Oh danger, no. That's a lot of things over there that I would like. I know I said I'll do one more day, but I kind of want to do this now. Yeah, I'm thinking we just go in there and take things. Katia can go there. Let's go. Oh, I feel like I know what this is, though. I feel like I know what this is. There won't be any danger, but this will give you... Uh, this, this is really a depressing part of the game. So materials, we'll keep it there. I didn't mean to take it. I just wanted to check what was over here. And I could just just kept it there. We'll just push this all over here. Yeah, let's do that. Those guys hate me now. Yeah, this is a whole couple place. It's gonna be so, so not cool. What I'm about to do, but it's something that is necessary that I do. It is necessary I do this. It is so not right to do it, but it is necessary that I do this because they won't do anything. They literally won't do anything to uh, anything I do, and it's it's good, but it's necessary that I do this. I'm just taking stuff uh, away from you. Sorry, dude. It's necessary for our survival. It's the it's just necessary. That's so much food, man. I'm sorry for everything, but this is necessary. Oh my god, it is so... It is so sad doing this to them, but it's just, I have to. Everybody at our place is not doing well, and... If if I wasn't doing better with materials, I would have... I would have said screw it, but... I am really bad right now on materials, and I kinda just... Don't have any choice. That's a sad part. I don't have any choice here. I'm low on materials and I just need stuff. Sorry, buddy. It's necessary. Oh my god. This make this game makes you This make uh, game makes a good job at making you feel like a bad person. Oh, this letter. Oh, last time I played this as well. I had, I had so much issues with this shit. But I have to. It is necessary that we beat this game and I just have to do this, man. Oh, God. Sorry, sorry, old man. Just sorry for everything. See, this is why I hate this game. 
It is not kind to you at all. Alright, let's see. We have a bunch of stuff here that we can just... We can just take. We'll take canned food because that'll help our guys uh, feel better. Uh, Sickness, yeah, that's definitely... Raw food, we definitely take all the raw food we have. I just take an extra space, I don't want that. What is this? Med ingredients. We don't have any med uh, things. Yeah. Oh, we definitely need this. We need a bunch of water as well. Electric parts, we'll take that as well. Might be useful. Let's take these materials. Uh, and that's a toy. We'll keep the toy for the time being. Uh, we'll take the medications. Not that bad. Herbs might be good. Coffee is fine by me. We don't need this. Herbal meds. For now, I don't want herbal meds. I just want these. Instead, we can just take wood. Which will be really good. Okay. I'm feeling good about this. We can go back. Well, I'm not feeling good about this, but yeah. Alright, so we'll do one last thing and then we'll be done for this video. Day 5. Man, these first 5 days have been brutal to us. Very hungry. Oh my god, she's sad because she looted those guys. Oh, where's Bruno, man? Hey boys, wake up. Yeah, Pauli needs to sleep still. He's slightly wounded yet. You guys are hungry, I know. She's very hungry. And tired. For now, just sleep. Uh, here. Okay. So, this takes five. Okay. It's better we just make four of these, right? Yeah, it's just better to make four of these. For now, just uh, sleep, Katia. Bruno will take care of Chef. We're gonna eat stuff and then have Katia eat it and then we can also give it to Pauli. Katia hasn't had food for a while. She needs it. Uh, there's also canned food which is good to know. Uh, Bruno can have canned food actually. Yeah, have canned food Bruno. Katia, you have food. Alright. Do you feel better? Good. Uh, Bruno, can you make some lockpicks? Would be really good to have lockpicks right now. Uh, wait, do I, uh, go back up there. I want to see. She's still hungry. Have another one. We don't have any, right? I just want to check that. Why did you stop eating that? Complete your share of food. Uh, we can't make any lockpicks yet. Good to know. We didn't have any materials because there were no materials in there. Okay, good. You're no more hungry. Can't make anything? We can't. Sleep. Cut here. Paule, uh, have some food for you. Uh, alright. So we can't make anything right now. We need a bunch of stuff to make stuff. And we don't have it. So... All I can say is that you guys hopefully feel better and I hopefully feel better playing this game later on. But that's all I got for today. Uh, Wait, does it say autosave? I don't know man. But I'll leave the game over here in case it doesn't record stuff. In case it doesn't have that uh, stuff recorded. Uh, I'll just, uh, well, not recorded, but saved. Uh, I'll just do it again uh, in the next video. But next time when we come around, hopefully we can progress the next five days without losing anyone. Because we almost lost power layer, and I don't want to go to that place again, because I know I will most probably die. So, until next time, boys. Peace out.